Ancient Egypt, one of the most misunderstood and misrepresented discoveries of the modern age. Since its rediscovery by Napoleon Bonaparte in 1798, every piece of the mysterious culture found in ancient Egypt has been catalogued and documented based on incorrect and preconceived viewpoints, with each new expedition having its own docket to push. Mainstream archaeologists tend to cover up the truth about ancient Egypt and how it was a culture that was far more advanced than they want to say, with technology and mastery of science beyond what we ever thought possible over 5,000 years ago. The truth behind the pyramids of Giza and the incredible civilization that created them has been suppressed starting with standing orders from Napoleon himself, and the veil of secrecy has been kept in place for over two centuries. Ancient Egypt a civilization shrouded in mystery and secrets, has left behind one of the most enigmatic legacies of our time, the Great Pyramids of Giza. These majestic structures, standing tall amidst the sands of the desert, hold within them a hidden knowledge that has eluded us for centuries. Scholars have long been puzzled by the means and methods used to construct these ancient wonders. Theories have been offered and disproven, researchers and archaeologists have been paid off and found to be frauds. The time has come to embrace the truth about this once great and powerful civilization that has been lost beneath the sands of time. The mainstream explanation of how the pyramids were built, and why falls short when one considers the precision and accuracy of their construction, and the lack of evidence of the tools and plans used to build them. Without a shred of a doubt, there is definitely more to this story than we have been asked to believe. Some experts propose that the pyramids of Giza were not merely structures, but rather ancient devices with a purpose far beyond our understanding. Could they have been structures used to harness power from the earth? harnessing the energy of the cosmos for the benefit of the ancient Egyptians? Or perhaps they were sources of power for the ancient shaman, who traveled to different dimensions and time periods in the ancient past? As we continue to explore the secrets of the pyramids, new findings and theories emerge that challenge our understanding of history and the world around us. The hieroglyphs and inscriptions left behind by the ancient Egyptians may hold the key to unlocking the true purpose and origins of these mysterious structures. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of ancient Egypt, we may discover a truth far more incredible than we could have ever imagined. Everything we have ever been taught about the ancient pyramids of Giza is false. If you think about any of the mainstream conventional explanations even for a second, the theories don't make any sense. These megalithic mystery structures have baffled scholars for centuries, and we are no closer to solving the mystery now. The Great Pyramids of Giza are clearly some kind of ancient lost technology that has been forgotten beneath the sands of time. Experts suggest that new findings from the lost pyramids finally reveal the truth behind these enigmatic and incredible ancient structures. The Pyramids of Giza have puzzled scholars for centuries and despite numerous studies, the methods and means used to construct these ancient wonders remain a mystery. Mainstream historians believe the pyramids were built by the ancient Egyptians, but new findings and theories suggest that there may be more to the story. The precision and accuracy of the pyramid's construction, as well as the lack of evidence of the tools used to build it suggests that something otherworldly may have played a role in their construction. The true purpose and origins of the pyramids may still be hidden in hieroglyphs and inscriptions waiting to be uncovered and understood. The pyramids of Giza are one of the most iconic and mysterious structures in the world, and their true purpose and origins have been a source of debate for centuries. The conventional explanation is that the pyramids were built by the ancient Egyptians as tombs for their pharaohs, but recent findings and theories have challenged this idea. The idea that the pyramids of Giza were an ancient superlaser weapon is a mainstream theory that is widely accepted by scholars and experts in the field. This is a far more credible theory compared to them being used as tombs, which has never made much sense because there has never been a sarcophagus discovered inside. The superlaser weapon theory has been proven to hold far more credibility in current academic institutions than any other theory as of today. According to this theory, the pyramids were built to harness and focus energy from the sun and stars, 
creating a powerful laser beam that could be directed at specific targets. The pyramid's shape, orientation, and internal structure were specifically designed to amplify and focus this energy, creating a powerful and destructive weapon. This theory is supported by a wealth of scientific evidence, including the pyramid's precise alignment with the stars and the sun, as well as the unique materials and structure of the pyramids. Studies have shown that the pyramid's internal structure and materials have unique electrical and magnetic properties in ancient times. The Great Pyramid of Giza was not a grand tomb for the pharaoh, but a powerful weapon of war. According to ancient texts and hieroglyphs, the pyramid was built with advanced technology and was capable of harnessing energy from the stars and the sun to create a powerful laser beam that could be shot out of the top of the pyramid. This would essentially obliterate invading armies. The pyramid's precise alignment with the stars and the sun, as well as its unique materials and internal structure, were specifically designed to amplify and focus the energy, creating a devastating weapon that could be used for defense. The ancient Egyptians were able to use this powerful weapon to defend their kingdom and repel invaders, striking fear in the hearts of their enemies. The laser weapon was so advanced and powerful that it was able to destroy entire armies in a matter of minutes, leaving no survivors to tell the tale. However, as time passed and the knowledge of how to operate and maintain the weapon was lost, the pyramid's true purpose and capabilities were forgotten. Today, the Great Pyramid of Giza stands as a silent testament to the advanced technology and power of the ancient Egyptians, its secrets waiting to be rediscovered. There has also long been rumors of a fabled second sphinx buried under the sands of Giza. In modern times we delve into the controversy surrounding the recent discovery of a new great sphinx in Egypt. According to some reports, the discovery is being concealed by the authorities and Egyptologists, raising questions about the true motives behind the secrecy. We will examine the evidence and theories behind this alleged cover-up, as well as the implications for our understanding of ancient Egyptian history and culture. Could this hidden sphinx hold the key to unlocking a new chapter in our understanding of the ancient world? The discovery of a new great sphinx in Egypt has caused quite a stir among archaeologists and Egyptologists. While the Sphinx is undoubtedly one of the most iconic and recognizable structures in all of Egypt, the discovery of a new one would be a significant event in the study of ancient Egyptian civilization. However, some researchers and independent investigators claim that the authorities in Egypt are intentionally hiding the discovery. They speculate that the reasons behind the secrecy could be political, financial, or even religious in nature. These allegations have ignited a firestorm of controversy in the academic community, with some scholars accusing the authorities of suppressing information that could challenge existing theories about the history and culture of ancient Egypt. Despite the rumors and speculation, the Egyptian authorities have not made any official or clear statements regarding the discovery most likely due to a hesitancy to rewrite many history books and upend academic literature. In fact, there is little concrete information available about the alleged new Sphinx, aside from some unverified reports and photographs circulating on social media. This has only fueled the speculation and fueled conspiracy theories surrounding the discovery. As researchers and experts continue to investigate this mystery, one thing is certain, the discovery of a new Great Sphinx, if true, could have profound implications for our understanding of ancient Egypt and its culture. It is essential that we remain vigilant in the pursuit of knowledge and understanding, and that we do not allow politics, finances, or any other factors to stand in the way of uncovering the truth about our past. One theory is that the Egyptian government is trying to protect its tourism industry by withholding information about the Sphinx. If a new Sphinx were to be found, it could draw significant attention and resources away from the country's existing tourist sites, potentially hurting the economy. Similarly, some argue that the Egyptian authorities might be trying to maintain control over the narrative of ancient Egyptian history, which could be challenged or rewritten by a new discovery. Another possible motivation could be religious or cultural in nature. Some have speculated that the discovery of a new sphinx could challenge or contradict established religious beliefs, or that it could be seen as a threat to the cultural identity of Egypt. This could lead to suppression of the discovery or efforts to downplay its significance. Finally, it's possible that financial interests could be involved in the alleged cover-up. 
there could be concerns about the cost of preserving and maintaining the new sphinx, or fears that it could be exploited for financial gain by outside interests. These recent baffling and incredible super-discoveries highlight the potential conflicts and motivations that could come into play when dealing with significant archaeological discoveries, particularly those that challenge existing beliefs or interests. Discovered by French soldiers in 1799, the Rosetta Stone became one of the most significant discoveries in the history of Egyptology. The stone contained a decree issued by ancient Egyptian King Ptolemy V in three different scripts, including hieroglyphs, which helped scholars to unlock the mysteries of the ancient Egyptian language. The French soldiers also made a different discovery, one that was said to be so baffling and earth-shattering that Napoleon Bonaparte himself ordered the discovery to be sealed and never spoken of again. What the French soldiers found was an incredible chamber underneath the paw of the Great Sphinx. The chamber was filled with artifacts, including rare and precious gems, scrolls, and artifacts dating back to the time of the Sphinx's construction. One of the most exciting finds was a set of scrolls containing ancient texts that had never been seen before. These texts shed new light on the construction of the Sphinx and the culture of ancient Egypt, revealing secrets that had been lost for centuries. Some of the texts hinted at the possibility of otherworldly involvement by mythical beings not found on this earth in the construction of the Sphinx while others detailed the engineering techniques used to build the massive structure. In addition to the scrolls, the soldiers found a series of intricate and beautiful statues that appeared to depict beings that were not human. Some of the statues seemed to resemble interdimensional beings, leading some to speculate that the Sphinx may have been built as a tribute to these visitors from beyond the stars or interdimensional beings, or visitors from the spirit realm. Recently the secret ancient chamber that had not been opened since the time of Napoleon in the 1700s was rediscovered, and unsealed for the first time in over three centuries. Reporting about this discovery was sparse at best, and quickly disappeared, leading some to believe that it was an orchestrated cover-up. As word of the discovery spread, the controversy over the Sphinx chamber's existence, and the alleged cover-up by the authorities intensified. Some researchers and conspiracy theorists argued that the chamber and its contents were proof of an interdimensional being presence in Egypt, while others accused the authorities of trying to suppress evidence that contradicted established beliefs and theories. In the end, the discovery of the secret chamber in the Great Sphinx would be a landmark event in the history of archaeology, revealing new insights into ancient Egypt and its culture but it would also raise profound questions about our place in the universe and our understanding of the past. Furthermore, the discovery of a secret chamber inside the Great Sphinx could potentially reveal new information about the purpose of the structure and the culture that built it. The ancient texts found in the chamber could provide new insights into the religious and spiritual beliefs of the ancient Egyptians, as well as shed light on the techniques and tools used to construct the Sphinx. The statues found in the chamber could also provide clues about the beliefs and worldviews of the ancient Egyptians. If the statues did, in fact, depict interdimensional beings, it could raise questions about the nature of interdimensional visitation and its influence on human civilization. In the end, the search for knowledge and understanding of our past is a never-ending process, and discoveries like this, if they were to occur, would provide new avenues of exploration and discovery. They would offer new perspectives on the history of human civilization and our place in the universe, opening up new possibilities for exploration and discovery in the future. In addition, the discovery of a secret chamber inside a great sphinx would also raise questions about the motives behind the alleged cover-up. Conspiracy theories aside, the authorities may have legitimate reasons for keeping such a discovery under wraps until they could conduct a thorough investigation and analysis of the findings. They may be concerned about the potential impact of such a discovery on the local economy, tourism, or the stability of the region. They may also want to ensure that any findings are verified and peer-reviewed before being made public, to avoid the spread of unfounded or misleading information. Regardless of the motives behind the very real cover-up, the discovery of a secret chamber inside the Great Sphinx would be a groundbreaking event that would capture the imagination of people around the world. It would be an opportunity for archaeologists, historians, and scientists to learn more about the past and potentially discover new insights into the origins of human civilization. 
Furthermore, the discovery of a secret chamber inside a new Great Sphinx could also have implications for our understanding of ancient cultures and their relationship with technology. If evidence of advanced technology were found within the chamber, it would challenge the conventional wisdom that such technologies were not available at the time the Sphinx was constructed. The discovery of such evidence could also spark new debates and discussions about the nature of technology and how it has shaped human history. It could even lead to new discoveries and innovations in the fields of archaeology and engineering, as scientists and researchers explore new ways of understanding the past and developing new technologies based on ancient models. The potential discovery of a secret chamber inside the Great Sphinx in Egypt, and what could be found inside, has captured the imaginations of people around the world. It could offer new insights into the ancient cultures that built the Sphinx, their religious and spiritual beliefs, and the tools and techniques they used to construct such remarkable structures. Perhaps they are hiding the secret about giant mega-guardians that were immortal beings that protected the pyramids for centuries, but then hardened to stone. The discovery of a secret chamber inside the Great Sphinx could also lead to new debates and discussions about the nature of technology and its impact on human civilization throughout history. It could potentially provide evidence of advanced technologies that were previously thought to be unavailable at the time of the Sphinx's construction. As we continue to explore the ancient sites of Egypt and other parts of the world, we must remember that there is still much we don't know about the people and cultures that built these structures. The history we were taught in school about ancient cultures was really just the best guess given the limited information archaeologists have had to work with. We must approach each discovery with an open mind and be willing to adjust our understanding of history in light of new evidence and insights. As the search for knowledge and understanding continues, it's important to remain committed to the principles of curiosity, skepticism, and scientific inquiry. By doing so, we can continue to uncover the secrets of our ancient past and gain new insights into the origins of human civilization. The pursuit of knowledge is an ongoing journey that requires a combination of scientific research and inclusion of cultural understanding. We must not dismiss the oral traditions passed down for centuries by native peoples of these lands. We must not only look at the structures themselves, but also the cultures and societies that built them in order to gain a fuller understanding of our shared history. The discovery of a secret chamber inside a new Great Sphinx in Egypt would be a momentous event that could have a significant impact on our understanding of history, as well as our current technological capabilities. It could help us to piece together the puzzle of how ancient cultures were able to create such magnificent structures and advance their technology in ways we previously thought impossible. However, it's important to remember that discoveries like these are not the end of the journey, but rather just one step in a long process of uncovering the secrets of our past. There is still much we don't know about the ancient world, and every discovery brings new questions and new avenues of exploration. In the end, the pursuit of knowledge is a never-ending journey, and every new discovery provides an opportunity for us to deepen our understanding of the world around us. We must remain curious, open-minded, and committed to the search for truth in order to continue to unravel the mysteries of our ancient past and gain new insights into the origins of human civilization. Join our channel as we seek the knowledge of truth about the origins of man and the vast unknown journey of our ancient past.